Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'll be doing a closure wig installation. Right here I'm using got to be glue gel and pushing my client's edges back. Then I'm going to blow dry it. I'm going to use a wig cap and place it over my client's head. Then I'm going to use the Got To Be Glued Free Spray, spray it across the hairline and blow dry it. This step is optional, a cap is not needed under your wig. Then you're going to use makeup closest to your client's skin complexion and place it across the hairline and in the middle. Now you're going to use small scissors and cut off all the cap that you won't be using. After you've done that, then you're going to use alcohol and wipe off all the makeup that was left on your client's forehead. This is a handmade wig using a 5x5 HD closure, two 28 inch bundles, and a 26 inch bundle. I've already plucked the bleach and tinted the lace. If you want to see how I do that, check out my other videos. Now you're going to use the same small scissors or a razor and cut across your client's lace in a zigzag motion. Using a tail comb, you're going to take out all the baby hairs that you want to use. When cutting your baby hairs, you want to cut them short, but not too short. The shorter they are, the more natural they would look. For your baby hairs, you want to use mousse to swoop them. To make it easier, I use my thumb to help me swoop them as you see me doing.
with your baby hairs, you're going to use a silk wrap to tie them down and let them dry. Right now I'm using mousse to place them on my client's part so when I'm hot combing the hair it can make it easier to flatten. Now I'm going to go part by part and use the hot comb to make the top flat. Bundles are already straight, I'm going to flat iron the hair in big chunks. First took off the silk wrap, I didn't like how the baby hairs came out, so I redid them and this is the outcome. Now I'm going to use a hot comb and hot comb the hairline of my client's wig.
When you finish hot combing both sides of the wig, you're going to use the tail comb and comb out your client's baby hair so it can look more natural. This is the finished look. Continue watching to see more clips of the outcome. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. Bye.